Hey guys, now we're gonna see what is the active discount display feature. So if you go in automatic discount and you click active discount display, you might be scared by seeing this screen, but don't worry, just follow the steps. First thing first, uh, you need to, well, you can test as an admin before unlocking this for $49.99. This is a one-time fee to unlock this add-on and it requires uh, to be on a premium account. So, and also it requires to edit your team's liquid files. So step one, you need to locate the card.liquid or card.template liquid file. To do so, you go to online store, you select your theme, and you land on something like that, and you search for cart. So here I see I have two cart templates. The first one is basically empty, I mean, it says that it contains the section cart template. So I go to section cart template and here I see the code of my cart page. The cart page is there and this is the code. So this is step one. I located the cart template dot liquid. Obviously, if you want to insert the script in any other page in the header, the footer, a blog post, whatever, you can do so. You copy uh, the script and you paste it in any of your uh, file here. So if I remove, I see all the files that I have or in a simple product page, for example, or a simple blog or page. Um, and then you can style it uh, with some CSS if you have some skills, uh, but you can just change, for example, the font style or the font size or to add a little background color or to to you know to make it dance or whatever you can do with the, with CSS I will show you how to do so something really simple but for now um, you need to de do the, these three steps you can show do it by yourself and you click here and that will open a blog post that basically explains some examples and if you scroll down you will see some more advanced stuff and that requires some javascript as well and this is not included uh, this is not included in in the in the add-on fee so if you want to hire us or any developer they can do something like savings minus this instead of just a sentence or something like that subtotal discount or this is an example but if you copy paste this it won't work in your theme because it's team related i mean it's team dependent so i have another example there here i have in the card drawer subtotal discount so let's go back to a simple example so this is a sentence that i've put here or there uh, that says that a discount will be applied at a checkout but in order to show this sentence, this notification, I actually need a discount to be applied at checkout via automatic discount. So if I go to checkout, I already have pre-filled the coupon field with the discount code. Um, but if, for example, I remove some products, oh, something went wrong. and I remove some product and I update and I don't meet the rule, the discount rule anymore, then the distance, the, the sentence is not displayed. But if I update it and then the, the pop-up is something else. And this is what we're talking about right now, the active discount display. If I want to change the location of it, well, I have put this here and I also have put it uh, well there but let's say I want to edit this one I'll search for okay so I have put it there but let's say that I want to, you could you could edit the text by the way but do not edit what's inside this 
uh, because this is this is the amount but you could also for example if you want to to have a different sentence you could just you could for example say um, well D discount well it makes no sense but D discount and this will be named the code or the name of the code coupon will be applied at checkout but that doesn't say anything to the users but anyway you have two variables that you cannot edit the text inside which is this one and the one that I just deleted this one discount code and discount amount you can remove them of course like I did here I remove the discount code to simply show the savings in dollars uh, but right now let's say I want to put this text at the right here so what I would do I could style it right there but not really so what I would do I would go to the team that CSS C S C S S dot liquid and at the very bottom I could uh, add <sighs> Just this is just a comment. And there I would need to grab this class. And I could put for example um, text align right I could play with the found size for example or I could do something maybe nicer Well, you should maybe use a class to highlight the text not to put the background color but this is just an example I'll pick a color for example this one is nice and I would save refresh Okay, so I broke something. I forget. Well, I would advise not to do it live. <laughs> so this is what I have, and I'm gonna remove this one because I don't want it to have it at two different locations. Okay, this is just cache, and that's why you see it twice, but it should be only there. Well, you could style it nicer than that and if you add some JavaScript uh, and you know you could show subtotal discount there but I'm just showing you an example of what could be done um, pretty quick again if you want to show this snippet in any other locations you can you just copy it and you put it uh, where you want it to be displayed and what is cool is that well once a rule is met, if someone lands on your cart page, you will see that he gets a discount at checkout. And if he goes to checkout, he gets this discount.